Today we have a ROM review for the i9-500. This is CM 10.2. Finally, clean Android. Now I know a lot of you with the Octa-Core version, the i9-500, are going to be pretty excited. This is Cyanogen Mod 10.2. So you can see that baseband is UMF8 and this is Android 4.3. We can also see that this is the unofficial version of Cyanogen Mod, um, but that's great because, it, well, in my opinion, I don't think there will be an official version, at least not for a long time. So this is great that we've got it here and it's working mostly. So this is an alpha. And what that means is it's not a beta, so there are a lot of things that are not working quite well yet. Uh, it does restart randomly sometimes, so this may not want to be a daily driver for you. Um, there's a, obviously with Cyanogen Mod we have all these features, like the clean Android is supposed to have. So with status bar we can change those battery symbols and have them with a, with a percentage in the middle. I quite like that. And we also have the ability to add profiles, you can see there. Uh, but anyway, enough of Summage and Mod, let's talk about what it does and what it can't do. So it's nice and fluid, it's an incredibly small ROM, has a small footprint. Uh, phone works, text messaging works, Internet Explorer works, all the widgets work, apps work. Uh, the only thing that doesn't work just yet is the camera. So I'll just go into the app now and show you, there we go, so it can't find the camera app and it will force close if I try and take a picture. So I hope that the 13 megapixel camera will work, uh, maybe a port from the Google Play Store edition of the Galaxy S4. Um, other than that, everything else works pretty well. Uh, obviously the system isn't entirely stable, there are a few uh, forced closes, uh, it does reboot, I've installed it probably for about 3 or 4 hours and I've had maybe 10 random reboots. So you may not want to use this as your daily driver, but definitely keep an eye on this thread. And when they fix all these problems, which may not be too long to be honest, uh, it'll be awesome. So this has been Kiwi Tech. Um, I'll put a link to the thread from XDA Forum in the description. And check it out. Definitely make it a favourite. So, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you haven't. And I'll catch you next time.